Hello friends, in this video, I am going to introduce you to a magical strategy that has a very high winning rate. This is a very accurate strategy with a very low error rate that you can trade with confidence even in the range chart. This strategy is an indicator-based method and you should use three indicators. I am sure that at the end of this video, you will be very happy after seeing this accurate method. Use this method to make money from Forex and cryptocurrency trading. So be sure to like this video and stay with me until the end of the video. So now let's learn how to use this strategy to make money. First, set the candlesticks to Heiken Ashi. Now we need to put the indicators we need on the chart. The first indicator we should use is called Chandelier Exit. Add this indicator to the chart. We need to make changes in the settings of this indicator. In the Style tab, except for the Buy and Sell label, turn off the other options. In the Input tab, change the ATR period value to 1 and the ATR multiplier value to 2.3. Now we need to add the second indicator to the chart to filter the wrong signals. The name of the second indicator we need to add to the chart is Jorgum Superscript. Add this indicator to the chart. Now in the Style tab, turn off all the options, and in the Input tab, change the value of T3 ma to 6 and 8, respectively, and adjust their colors according to the video. Therefore, the color of the indicator becomes clearer and we can see the indicator better on the chart. We have now created two conditions for entering the trade on the chart. And to enter a buy trade, we enter when the first indicator gives us a buy signal and the second indicator changes from red to blue. To enter a sell trade, we enter when the first indicator gives us a sell signal and the second indicator changes from blue to red. But despite the use of these two indicators, there are still wrong signals. To make this strategy as accurate as possible, we add a third indicator to the chart, which is the RSI indicator with the new settings. And we receive the final confirmation to enter the trade from the RSI indicator. Now let's add the RSI indicator to the chart. As I said, there is a need to make changes to the RSI indicator settings. In the input tab, Change the value of RSI length to 25 and the value of MA length to 150. Make sure MA is in SMA mode. In the Style tab, we make the RSI line a little thicker. Well now let's test the strategy completely using all three indicators. The first condition to enter the trade was to show the sell signal or buy signal by the first indicator on the chart. The second condition for entering the trade was to change the color of the second indicator. To enter the sell trade, the color of the indicator had to be changed from blue to red, and to enter the buy trade, the color of the indicator had to be changed from red to blue. But the third condition is that if we assume that we receive a sell signal from the previous two indicators, to confirm this signal, the blue line must cross the yellow line downwards in the RSI indicator. And if we assume that we receive a buy signal from the previous two indicators, to confirm this signal, the blue line must cross the yellow line upwards in the RSI indicator. Now let's look at some examples of trading with this strategy. Now see some examples of how to trade with this strategy in other charts. I hope you found this video useful. Be sure to subscribe to the Magic Trading Strategy YouTube channel to see the rest of the channel videos.
Encourage me to continue working by liking this video.